time can be posted into Centerbase through several different screens. So one screen is behind Blue Plus, Billing Entry, Time. And so here you can post time directly into Matters. This is the more summary screen that is missing a few of the features we like on a different screen, so we typically don't use this. The other screen we like to see for entering time is Timesheet. And this has a couple different features we want to walk through. So the first is a timer. And so let's go ahead and start timer. And it says, no, we need the matter first. So we can quickly add a matter. And so if we know what we're going to do, we can type in our note. So what it's going to do, it's going to start a timer for this matter. Timer. And it's running. And so we're done with the task. And so it automatically posted the time entry for that item. We need to edit the note. We click on the line and we can edit the note. And update. Next thing we can do is we can just manually post time into matters. So we're going to pick the matter, hourly fee, worked an hour. So here's our, here's our invoice note. And this is an internal note. And so we can save or we can save and duplicate. The save and duplicate is handy as if we've been working on this matter all day. And so we have to post you know, three hours into the matter. One hour is for this task that we're posting now. And then we also have to report another two hours into the separate task. So to speed entry, we hit save and duplicate. So it pushed our hour down into the entries. And at the top, it just recopied all of the information that was on there. So this was the task two, there's gonna be two hours. And we can make this invoice note for task two and save. And so it just allowed you to avoid going through and fishing through and finding the exact matter for that second time entry. And on this little screen over here, we're getting a real-time report of our billable hours for the day and our billable hours for the week. That firms will often have billable hour goals for the week, and this will track progress. The timekeepers can see their progress towards that goal. It also provides a nice context that if you've been at work for 10 hours today and you're posting your time and there's only five hours here, that that's a good sign you should go back and find your other missing five hours. Or if you're posting time and you've reported 30 hours for the day, you might want to reconsider what you're posting for time. And with that, it's a quick introduction to entering time into Centerbase. Thanks.